Alright, 361 Corpus Christi, Texas here, and uh, today we have made a 2 meter coil antenna for uh, 2 meters for 144 and for 444. Because there's a repeater on 444 megahertz that I actually talk on, and uh, my call sign is KJ5GHX. And this is just a prototype here where this coil is wrapped around a uh, pill bottle form. Got it coiled around. We got probably about a two inch screw that sticks off the top of it. We got it hooked up to the portable dipole. We got a jumper wire that goes over to the UHF to SMA and goes into the bow fang here. So right now I am going to show you the clip that I had whenever I was actually testing it out and I got a contact with the owner of the repeater and so I'll show you that one. Um, on that one I did have to take off the uh, tape on top because it was actually coming undone and everything so I took that off. So in the next uh, here in a few seconds you'll see a video of the actual receiving the transmit. The uh, repeater that I'm transmitting to from this actual coil antenna here is actually in Taft, Texas, so it's, it's quite a ways from me. And it is hooked up straight to the, the Balfang radio. So it definitely is going through there. There's no other antenna that I'm going through. And I do have trees in the way, and I do have a house in the way as well. And I'm still making it out to Taft, Texas. So it's pretty good for a little tiny uh, coil antenna for two meters. I can definitely reach out to Taft, Texas on the repeater, which is actually really good for this itty bitty thing. Next thing, I'm gonna get a pill, uh, not pill bottle, a PVC form for uh, final testing, and I'll be selling that on Facebook Marketplace. The copy on it is actually really good. I'm receiving you pretty good. Uh, how's it sound over there for me? Yeah, the receive on it is sounding pretty good. Uh, I think the static could be just the wind and everything, and I'm holding the wire with my finger. <laughs> 